reason our program exists is because there, is, there are not other resources in the community to help people get IDs. Um, and we have kind of perfected this art over the years, but it's not easy to come to know all of the, to help navigate the process with people, um, to recognize all of the steps it takes to get an ID. It's just a long struggle for people who don't drive, who don't have the means, and who aren't able to walk in and get an ID. We also know that a lot of the people who would be cut out by this amendment have a lot going on in their lives, and just to add one extra step is, it's, it's enough to prevent them from voting. It's their right to be able to vote, and it isn't a, the American way, I'll say, to make it hard for people to vote. We see close to 4,000 guests in our program each year. Um, and so we know that at least that many people in the St. Louis area need help accessing an ID and that's not an accessible, it's not accessible to them. You need a birth certificate. Everyone that we see is not born in Missouri. So we have to send out of state. The cost can be as much as $30 in some states. It can take as long as four to six weeks for people to get them. Once they get them, then they have to come back here so we can give them a voucher that's worth $11 to go to City Hall or to Northside to get their Missouri IDs. If Amendment 6 passed, and the, even if the state of Missouri said they would cover the cost, of all of the ideas that people needed, even if that were the case. It's, it's confusing for people, and I think if, if folks knew or heard that there was a photo ID requirement for voting, that would prevent a whole group of people from even trying to vote. They have a wonderful philosophy of life. You have to have hope. You have to keep going. So it keeps me coming back just to meet these people that keep me going. Since we know how hard it is, we can't we have to be involved. We, there's no other choice. We, um, we just know so acutely how, how this would affect the people we work with, and we think it's so important that everyone has access to voting as one of the, the most basic right that we have as Americans.